Hi, I'm Amelie and I'm with Systematic Excellence Consulting and today I'm going to go over chat inside of ClickUp. Okay, so you can have chat at different levels. Um, you can have it at the space level, the folder level, the list level. Um, and so I have some examples here that I just set up just to be able to show it. So right now I have a space selected and I created a chat. Um, you can rename the chat if you want. So I might call this, we'll call this internal chat. And then maybe I want to have an additional one. I can click on chat. So I click on the three dots, click on chat, add view. And it's going to add a second chat. And then I just click to toggle to see both of them. Maybe I want to rename this one to um, client chat. So then what it allows me to do is I can have two chats in with maybe my team and then a chat with the client. Um, it gives me ability to do that. Um, you can add it here. You can do it at the folder level. Um, so I've already added one here. So let's say maybe you don't want to have um, an external chat with the client in the space, but just because maybe you break your clients down that each client gets a folder. So again, I'm going to rename this one. We'll call this um, internal. And then let's add, um, we'll, I'll add another chat view. And I'll rename this one client or you could use the client's name whichever you prefer but what it does is it allows you to um, have different chats here and then when you so I I <laughs> um this is our test account and then I also connected it to our paid account so that's why my name is there so it's me messaging myself essentially but anyway so inside the chat you can um, assign comments uh, so that way they'll get a notification. Even if you just mention them in it, uh, they will still get a notification, their notification center. Um, assigning it I get, gives it a little bit more priority, I think. Um, you can mention someone. You can even mention tasks in here um, if you want to, um, if you want to do that. So, hey, uh, please check this today and then you can select a you can select which task you want to you know, you want to do you just send it and then if they click on it it'll open the task up so you can see it okay so uh, you can add emojis you can use the slash commands you can also do screen records and um, put them uh, directly into the chat you can add files here and put them in the chat. And again, if you have a second chat window open here, then you um, you can have you know certain people that are in here. You can add people as watchers on here. So maybe um, you want them to just be aware, but you don't um, you're not mentioning them in a in a comment, but you want them to see the conversation. You can add them as watchers. Uh, and again, you can do the same with the other one. So you can also do it at the list level. So um, I'm just gonna click on this list level. I had already created a chat. So again, you can have it at the list level. I think where what really matters is where you're gonna need to have the communication with either your team or your client um, as far as what at what level you would put the, um, the chat function. Um, I personally would put it at the client, the folder level. If you're using each client gets a folder, that's where I'd put the chat. Um, but if you just want them, their input on a specific phase or a specific list, then you can do that as well. One of the other great things that you can do here um, is do dashboards. I will be going over dashboards in depth in another video, but I just wanted to show you um, what you can also do. So you can set up a widget right in here that would um, allow you to have the chat in the dashboard versus in the, um, in the, in the area with the folders in the list. So that is 
ClickUp chat. Um, it's really helpful. It's a great way to collaborate in real time with your team or your clients. And again, you can do it in the dashboards or you can do it in the folders, the lists, um, or spaces. Um, okay, so I'm Amelie. I'm with Systematic Excellence Consulting. Thank you so much for watching. If you're looking for additional help or one-on-one -on -one support on how best to use ClickUp or getting projects planned or processes planned in ClickUp, there's a link below that you can book a free call um, and we can see if we can um, get you help. Um, make sure you subscribe to catch our future videos. Thank you.